guys, welcome to the vlog. Today, I have something I really want to talk about. Tito! Yeah, what's up? I need Teeds in here for this. All right, Teeds. Mm. And you sit right here. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> We're gonna talk about my problems. All right, I'm listening. And my investments. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, I'm gonna tell you a story. So, after the Super Bowl in Tampa, where Tom Brady and the Buccaneers beat the Kansas City Chiefs, I became really good friends with Antonio Brown, okay? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you did. Yeah. So, I ended up buying his touchdown ball from the Super Bowl, like the ball that he caught in the Super Bowl. I bought it. And so, it's right here. So, I bought it, you know, and it was Tom Brady's... Uh, it was Tom Brady's third touchdown pass of the game. His first two were to Rob Gronkowski. But this one was to Antonio Brown in the Super Bowl. He caught it. Looks good, huh? I mean, it does look good. It is my favorite thing that I've ever collected in sports memorabilia, okay? Okay. It's my favorite thing ever because I've always wanted, I've always wanted in my lifetime a Tom Brady touchdown ball. Mm -hmm. And I've also always wanted a game-used Super Bowl ball from Tom Brady. But I never thought in a million years that I would get a Tom Brady Super Bowl touchdown ball, right? Okay. I also did not ever think that I would get Tom Brady's last Super Bowl touchdown ball because this is the last touchdown he's ever thrown in a Super Bowl. Unless he goes back and does it this year, not looking so good. <laughs> not by the way he's playing. Yes, but if he doesn't go back to another Super Bowl... That will be the last ball. Yeah, if he doesn't go to another Super Bowl... This will be Tom Brady's last touchdown ball in a Super Bowl, which is insane. I never thought that I would have that. And also, I didn't mean for that to happen. I just wanted a Tom Brady touchdown ball. Yeah, just any ball? Yeah, and, and when Antonio Brown said, sure. Sweet. So I've had this for two years now, and I love it. I never want to sell it. It's something I love, and I want Tom Brady to sign it really bad. <laughs> He's not going to sign that thing. <laughs> He's not going to sign that. Let me tell you no. my problems oh here it is come on antonio brown there oh wait what why are you doing this to me no listen what do you mean i should have gotten listen okay so guys let me just tell you the story i won the all-in challenge and i was supposed to have dinner with tom brady in 2020 so in 2020 i won this bid thing where you could go have dinner with tom brady the dinner has not happened yet that was two years ago it's 2022 the dinner has not happened yet. And no, there's not me complaining. They postponed it because obviously COVID. And then after that, there were other problems. And like, they just keep postponing it. The last time the dinner was supposed to be was in August. But then Tom Brady started having marital problems. And then he postponed it again. But he's done, I, I have two game-worn jerseys from him. I've FaceTimed him. You know, I've met him a lot of times. I'm not complaining about that. But what I'm saying is I wish the dinner would have happened after the Super Bowl because him and Antonio Brown were still cool. <laughs> And then Tom Brady, his magical signature, would have been right here. <laughs> right next to who? Right next to Antonio Brown. The guy who caught it. Mm -hmm. So here's the thing. Here's why I'm mad. Antonio Brown has done everything in his power to make Tom Brady hate him. He has done everything. He's posted pictures of, of him and Tom Brady's wife on Instagram. He did? Yeah. Oh my God, Tito, Tito, doesn't, Tito doesn't know what I'm talking about. I gotta show it. Yo, this is all new to me. No, 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 no. You gotta see what this guy's doing. He's a fiend. He's, in his words, a gremlin. <laughs> no, he did not. Yes, he said he's no, on, he did not. He said he's on gremlin mode. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? Look, look at this. He posted a picture of him and Tom Brady's wife after the Super Bowl. Oh no, he, he's a little too happy. Uh-huh. Yes. He's trying to get Tom Brady to hate him. Oh no no, look what he posted on Twitter. I'm not done. Look what he posted on Twitter. No, this is this is the worst one. Hopefully he didn't delete it. Well, hopefully he did. <laughs> hopefully he did delete it. But no, knowing him, he posted, uh, it's, it's loading. He posted, Daddy doesn't live here anymore. <laughs> no, he did not. It, it, shows, it shows Tom Brady leaving, his wife at the door, and then it shows Antonio Brown inside the window. Mm, no, he didn't. He did. He did. Tom Brady let Antonio Brown live with him during the season. Antonio Brown, no team wanted to sign him. No team. And Tom Brady vouched for him and said, buddy, I got you. Come stay with me. I'll help you. And he did all that. Tom Brady helped Antonio Brown in every way possible. And Antonio Brown ended up winning a Super Bowl. That's, that's how he caught this ball. Now Antonio Brown's doing Tom Brady the most dirty ever. 
And so now when I go to dinner with Tom Brady, do you think he's signing that ball? No, he's not signing that ball. No? No, he's taking it. He's, he's going to pop it. <laughs> he's going to pop it? <laughs> like, screw that. So, guys, hopefully Tom Brady doesn't watch this. Oh, my gosh. You got two? You got two. Okay, guys, let me explain to you what this ball is. Please explain. So, when Antonio Brown sold me this ball, he said, I got some more stuff that you might want. All right? Okay. And then he said, I have this touchdown ball. I bought it because I was like, ooh, another Tom Brady touchdown ball. Mm -hmm. But then I realized it's another milestone ball. What? This is this is Tom Brady's first playoff touchdown ball since he became a Buccaneer. The opening drive against the Washington football team. Brady, it was the Buccaneers wild card game. It was the opening drive. Brady hit Antonio Brown for this touchdown. And that's why it was the first ball of the game. And it was Tom Brady's first playoff touchdown as a Buccaneer. And look whose signature's on it. <laughs> Tony Browns. And guess whose signature I want on it? Let me guess. Tom Brady right here? Uh-huh. Yeah. Is that happening? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's not happening, bro. What? Okay. No. Okay. Okay. So here are my options. But there is no options. No, there, there's options. White out. Well, okay, no. So this was signed with a paint pen, right? So you can either try to wash off the signature. <laughs> and then Tom Brady thinks he's just signing a normal ball. Yeah, of course. I mean, he's gonna see the, the Super Bowl look. <laughs> oh, okay. Or or is what we do. I noticed that when a player makes a big catch in a game, mm -hmm. or if it's an important ball, they tape it. They put tape around it. So what we could do is we could get like a tan tape and like wrap this part of the ball. So he's like, oh, okay. And he just signs right here. What? Like we, we, we cover up the signature. So all Tom Brady sees is that. Antonio Brown's a Hall of Famer. I know he's doing a lot of stuff off the field, like assaulting people and... You know, memes and stuff. Yeah, and, and doing just... And, and really just... Really doing a lot of crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. But let's just focus on the field. Oh, well, I mean, if I say that, he did run off the field and th take his clothes off. Okay, well... <laughs> That's it? Yeah, he, he, he took off his jersey and he, and he ran off the field. Oh, he's done. Yeah, he never played again. He just quit halfway through the game. He took his jersey off and he quit. Shoulder pads. Mike Evans, OJ Howard, trying to convince him to keep them on. Obviously, they were unable to do so. He tossed his shoulder pads, tripped off his shirt and gloves, threw those into the crowd, then ran across the field while the teams were still on the field, giving the crowd. <laughs> and then when they asked him why he did it, he said he was on gremlin mode. Still? <laughs> what? Bro, relax. How do you turn it off? So you remember when we lost to the Rams? Mm hmm He was supposed to be on the team. Anyway, the reason why I'm making this vlog, guys, <laughs> the reason why I'm making this vlog, guys, is this is my problem. I haven't had dinner with Tom Brady yet. I really, really want Tom Brady to sign these balls for me. And if he could only sign one, of course, it's the Super Bowl ball, right? But I feel like, I'm like, hey, can you sign this? Sure. What the hell is it? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, why? Why did you bring this upon me? Yeah, like, is it insulting to ask him to sign it? But he threw it. It's his last Super Bowl touchdown throw. Now, here's my biggest fear. My biggest fear is he goes to the Super Bowl this year, loses. Of course, I always want Tom Brady to go back and win. Like, I mean, if, he, if, if you want to play better and win, I'd like that. But <laughs> what I'm saying is when I bought this ball, I didn't know it was going to be his last Super Bowl touchdown ball. So, yeah. Guys, what would you do? Do you think Tom Brady would notice the signature? 100%. Do you think he's going to see this video and go, oh, hell no, I'm canceling the dinner? Yes. <laughs> we could wrap the ball in like a shiny vinyl and then just leave the spot open right here. It's like, oh, can you sign it on the ballpark? Yeah, just right there. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> it's just a ball. Just sign it. <laughs> sign the damn thing. Sign the damn thing. Just throw me, please. <laughs> Stand me, please. Sign it. Sign it. No. <laughs> okay. So guys, um, yeah, so we have Tom Brady's first playoff touchdown pass as a Buccaneer. And then Tom Brady's last Super Bowl touchdown ball in the Super Bowl. And it just so happened to be the same person that's going Looney Tunes. Who's going Gremlin mode. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, uh, how do we get Tom Brady to sign it? Not happening. It's not happening? No. Why not? <laughs> it's not happening. I know I wouldn't. Guys, I also have Antonio Brown's game-worn jersey from the Super Bowl. But I didn't feel like pulling that out because I don't need anyone else to sign that. <laughs> I, just, I need Tom Brady to sign these. Um, so, Antonio Brown, if you could please calm down. I think the damage is done. It's over. But if you could become friends with him again, just for a little while. Say, sorry, man. I was, 
drunk, or sorry man, I'm tired. I just want Tom Brady's time. I don't plan on selling these things. Now, if I were to be homeless, like if I were to lose it all, then obviously I'd have to sell it. But right now, I just want to keep it forever, like and pass it down to generations, especially this one. But if I ever had to sell it, Antonio Brown, you're really making the value plummet. Plummet. Yeah, it's, it's gone. Like, it's, it's, it's over. So yeah, guys, you know, chances of Tom Brady signing it the way it is. 5%. 5%? Uh-huh. And that's if he doesn't notice. Exactly. The moment he does, it's over. What would he do if he was about to sign it and he notices it? He would have been like, I I'm not, I'm not signing this. I want to sign that thing. If you helped someone, like if someone lived with you, you helped them their whole career, and then uh, they say they slept with your wife, basically. Twice! <laughs> Twice! He made a meme! He made a meme, he's in the damn house! <laughs> he's in the house and I'm like, no! And no! I'm not signing it. I'm, hell no! <laughs> hell no, man! Dinner too? So anyway, guys, that does it for today's vlog. This is my predicament. What do I do? Well, Tom, do you think Tom Brady will sign it? Do you think Tom Brady would notice? If you guys want to see any more of my memorabilia collection, let me know because I don't know. I have a lot of cool. I have a lot of cool stuff. I do. I have the coolest. I have stuff that people can't get. Some people collect Digimon cards, <laughs> which I still collect those things. Of all the things you thought of, Digimon. I couldn't say the thing I wanted to say. Uh, mm. Like some people collect. Bottle caps. See, I like collecting statues. Right? I like to collect the the, the sp sports memorabilia that like is so cool. Like, cause like a, a, a Tom Brady Super Bowl touchdown ball. How? So guys, if you want to see me do a memorabilia vlog where I talk about sports stuff, I know this is probably gonna get like ten thousand views, but I, I didn't do it for the views. I did it for honest help. Help me. He needs help. Cause I no way in hell this is getting signed. I, bro, I'm telling you this. He's once he sees that eighty one. <laughs> no. He's gonna be like, sorry, <laughs> sorry, big dog. You thought, sorry, big dog. <laughs> Ain't happening, big man. <laughs> <laughs> but it's your last Super Bowl touchdown ball. Well, he went gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if he says to my face, he went gremlin, <laughs> then I will. I won't be sad. <laughs> He's not signing that damn ball. <laughs> Let it go. Don't just end this damn thing. And here's the thing: I can't sell it to the Hall of Fame. They don't want that. <laughs> gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna be like, we really would have wanted it if he didn't sign it. <laughs> it like, it would have been perfect. Except you got that signature. <laughs> what? I have two historic balls in the NFL history, and you're, they're like, I he went gremlin. Once you go gremlin, you don't go back. Uh, no. Not only, guys. No, I have to. Not only is Antonio Brown trying to make it that Tom Brady will never sign my ball. He's also trying to make sure he gets canceled. In the worst way. <laughs> he wants to make sure his name is worth pennies. What do you mean? No, he did not. Uh-huh. No, he did not. Uh-huh. No, he didn't. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, he's... Oh, oh the comments are not... They're not looking too good. <laughs> he put the tweet! He said... Uh, I'm not going to say it, but he said that... Burn the ball. <laughs> Burn the ball. How much is that ball worth now? Nothing. <laughs> nothing is worth gremlins. <laughs> that, that, that's, worth, that's worth nothing. Uh, I'm so glad you bought it because. No, I'm so glad you. I'm so glad you bought it to keep it. Oh, uh, okay. Good. I'm so glad you bought it to keep it because that's worth nothing. <laughs> nothing. Well, I don't plan on selling it. G good. <laughs> don't even pass it down. <laughs> no, actually, you know what? Make the ball, you know, get Barry with you. Uh, yeah. yeah. Because I promise you, that's worth nothing. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> good thing you're a collector. Uh, what's the worst thing about that Antonio Brown did? Yeah, I mean, you saw him run off the field. You saw him post about Tom Brady's wife, and then you just saw the Cardinals meme. When Tom Brady's leaving the house. That's bad. Oh, 100%. Okay, but you did see him. Sexually assault a woman in Dubai, right? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? What do you? The... How much do you have? <laughs> you still gribbling? <laughs> what? Dubai? Hold on, I, I gotta show you that too. You're gonna make the case for it, okay? Oh my God, Tito, he doesn't stop. All this has happened in the last two weeks. <laughs> and then hold on, he, he pulled his wiener out. Hold on. No, he does not. Yeah, he does. You saw it. So, um, it is, uh, it, 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 Antonio Brown exposed himself at Dubai Hotel Pool. Okay. <laughs> Get rid of the ball. What? Get rid of the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Burn it.
Get rid of that damn ball. <laughs> it's worth nothing. <laughs> it's worth nothing. So, if I would have had my dinner with Tom Brady right after the Super Bowl, Antonio Brown was still part of the team. Uh huh. Everything was good. Oh, 100%. Then he talked shit about Tom Brady. Yup. Said that he basically post memes about him and his wife. Mm hmm. Did the pull thing to a girl, showed his wiener. I mean, it wouldn't affect Tom Brady, but it, it, it affects it, it affects everyone else. It affects his name. Yeah, that Tom Brady doesn't want to be associated with him. Ex oh, and he did everything to do to save this man. Mm -hmm. For what? So don't you see why I'm not happy? Yes, I do. I do. He's not signing that damn ball. Not. No. No, he's not. So what, what happened to the five percent? Five percent zero. <laughs> Actually, negative. If there was a way to remove the signature, would you say do it? Yes. <laughs> mm-hmm. You would? Do it. If there's a way, do it. Because right now, he, and I saw it, <laughs> I would have been like, what the hell is this? All right, all right, Tito. Act like you're a buyer, and you're really interested until you see the signature. Okay. Excuse me, sir. I have Tom Brady's first playoff touchdown ball. Wait, his first playoff? First playoff touchdown. From the Buccaneers? From, from the Buccaneers. His first ever. How? How did you even get this? I'm, I'm just looking to sell it. Oh my god. Can you please tell me how much I'll get for it? Yo, you can easily get like thousands, maybe even hundreds of thousands. What's wrong? Get the ball. What, well, how much will you give me for it? Nothing. It's Tom Brady's first. It's, it's Tom Brady the Gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, he, he's a Hall of Famer. Don't his sexual harassment. He caught the ball. I do not care who caught the ball, except it was him. Well, he wouldn't sign it because. Yeah, because he's all his name, huh? Cause, cause he's he's all his name. He wouldn't sign it because the gremlin. The gremlin. <laughs> His name's worth zero. That does it for today's vlog, guys. What would you do? John Quinones, what would you do? <laughs> no, what would you do? Guys. <laughs> <laughs> Just let the girl die. <laughs> so, guys, I'll let you know when the Tom Brady dinner is. And, uh, and I'll see. We'll do another update. We're saying he did not sign the ball. Yeah. Guys, place your bets in the comments. Will he sign it? Will he not? I'll see you guys later. No, we won't. Tito, if you ever are going psychotic crazy and you're about to commit a lot of crimes, call me and go, Logan, I'm going gremlin. No, Logan, I'm going gremlin mode. <laughs> no, gremlin. Don't feed him after midnight. He's eating. <laughs> he's, he's eating. All right, guys, I'm going to go put these back in my, uh, the trash. The trash. I like that. <laughs>